This is your KCTV 5 News Update. Kansas Governor Laura Kelly has signed a bill that will allow the state to offer up to $1 billion in incentives to try and land a large new employer. State leaders say Kansas is one of two finalists for the project. The company remains a secret, but Kelly says it would bring 4,000 new jobs to the state. Kansas City Mayor Quentin Lucas is proposing a budget that he says will make the city safer and cleaner. The proposed budget for the 2022-23 fiscal year totals $1.9 billion. Last night in his State of the City address, the mayor said that includes money to hire an additional 150 police officers, pay raises for officers, and raises for other city employees. Today we learned also about some of the other items in the budget that focus on cleaning up the city. They include $600,000 for litter cleanup, $650,000 to expand bulky item, more than $2 million to buy four new street sweepers, and $2 million for demolishing dangerous buildings. And here's an item that many are interested in this time of year, snow removal. The budget includes $600,000 to buy new snow removal vehicles. So the next step in this budget process will be a series of public hearings. First one will be held virtually on February 19th. Then it will be up to the City Council to approve it. Good Thursday evening to you, Kansas City. We're keeping an eye on just a little bit of rain over the next 24 hours. I have a 30% chance of a few isolated showers across our area for Friday morning. Many of us are going to be completely dry for your Friday and enjoy those temperatures very spring-like for one more day. So we're looking ahead to the weekend. It looks like we will get more of a winter feel by Saturday. High of 33 on Saturday, but back to near 40 by Super Bowl Sunday. Turn to KCTV 5 News for the latest all day. This is your personalized update because KCTV 5 News stands for you.